Now we got to take that off, the, 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 the chuck off. Take that off. All right. I can oh, I gotta do it. I can do it. I know. Okay, got got a chuck wrench. Take a wrench. There, there's one. and I'm going to do what he just said. You want to hold him? No, you can't. Hi, my name is Jerry Walsh. Uh, I'm here today to show my son, Eric, how to use the wood lathe. This is his first time, and uh, so we're just going through the basics and using the, just the crude amount of tools. And this is what we hope to try to make, finished products. <laughs> Yep, tool rest down. Yep. Boy, you got a lot of cords. I see. Alright. I got my grandfather who had that jacket that nobody wants. He said, bless his heart, men cannot have enough cords. I remember him saying that. Okay, now put the supposed stale stock down. What? Don't worry about that. That's okay. Push the tail stock down. You gotta loosen it. Loosen it? Yep. Okay. Okay, slide it. Oh, gosh. Just... Oh, Lord it Jesus! It should be hard! Loosen it and slide it. What? No, 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 what are you doing with the wrench? Eric, there's a handle down there. Are you using the handle? No, no, okay, use that. Just move it down a half a turn. It's a cam off. There's a cam. There you go. I was trying to unscrew it all. It's a cam. Alright. Not a cam. It's a cam. Slide it down, get it, get it in. Okay. Now, it's not hitting the center. That's uh, fine. Okay. It's good. That, 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 that. No, you can't tighten it first, otherwise you just push it back. Push the lever down. It's a cam. Is, okay, if you got a problem, stop. What? Get it loose. Reach underneath, underneath the blade, underneath the blade. No, way underneath it. There, there's a nut, a big nut. Uh -huh. Give it a little turn. To tighten it? Yeah, it loosens it. Now I'll use the can. There you go. Now it should tighten. Now, there uh, on the back, tools. I tools. Will. There you want to go. Light. Yeah, there you go. Bring it across. That's it. Now you're digging too deep. Take little cuts. Go all the way across. catching on you. Okay, uh, let's do this. What? What am I doing wrong? Your, your tool rest is loosened up again. Yeah, we'll okay, go. and just, just do that and just do scraping cuts across. Try that. No, no, cross like that. Like what? Like that, yeah. On the tool rest. And hold it down. And don't go all the way in, because the wood sticks out farther than you can see. See, your job is to try to get that smooth, so you're hitting the high spots first. Right now, things are going fairly well. 
on your tool rest. That tells you how far away it should be. No closer than this, no farther than that. So, this rests here? No, no, you're going to go on the inside and start hopping. No, 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 like you had it before. No, 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 keep going. And by the way, uh, it says robust on my lathe. I got to be honest, that is obviously not a robust lathe. I can't afford a robust lathe. They are the most expensive lathes in the world. Did you get a sticker? So I bought a decal. <laughs> Thanks to these expert tips, making bowls are easy and fun too.